My name is Lilian Chapkwaich Korir. I am 18 years old. I come from Nakuru County, Keringet, Kapsimbewa village. I'm the second born in a family of five. I have one sister and three brothers. My passion at least lies on changing people's life in whatever small ways we can do or we can contribute at least to change the lives of our people. I went to school at Kapsimbewa Primary School and then at some point in class 7 I got a scholarship, went to another school in Akuru called Akesha Grassland Academy, worked hard and got 388 marks at my KCPE, becoming the best in the school. So my primary school head teacher advised me to apply for the Wings to Fly program. So when I joined the Wings to Fly program, it enabled me to go to Marymount Secondary School, paid for my fees, at least my shopping, and my pocket money. That's where I learned for my four years. Uh, Lillian was a humble student from the Wadigo, from when she was in Form 1. Uh, she was brilliant to the extent that by the end of the first year of her study, the whole school knew for real due to her stunning performance. She's one student who would assist me more so when maybe I'm not even in class, she would lead the others. Actually, she was a peace setter in that class. From very early in her studies, actually in the second term in this school, or what you would call second semester in this school, she showed a, to be a very bright student. She never came here as the brightest, but by second term, she had caught up and passed every other student who was ahead of her and maintained her position up to the, four, the, la, uh, the end of the fourth year. Lillian has been uh, the best example, a beacon for the others. In many occasions, she has come back here to talk to the girls. In other words, she has taken up a mentorship role seriously. I came from a humble background. It doesn't really matter. The same books that you have in class, everyone reads it, irrespective of where you come from, which is still good. You know, some people will ask me, how do you manage to be like the first every time you have to have like no competitor? But I mean, sometimes it's just self-discipline. Try fighting with yourself. Try seeing what you can do better than what you did the other time. Lillian, having gotten an A from the same background as I, inspires me because it does not matter how, where you come from, but if you have that drive to reach your goal, you will be able to excel. Tulishukuru kabisa wings to fly kwa sababu walitusaidia kabisa hiyo pesa ilikuwa mingi sana kwa hiyo nini shule ya Merima kwa sababu ilikuwa county school. Sasa hiyo pesa ya kulipa shilingi elufu sabini kwa mwa, kwa mwaka ilikuwa pesa mingi kabisa na tu ungekuwa na uweza kabisa ya kutoa hiyo pesa mahali. The wings to fly scholars who are ahead of me told us that if you attain a grade of A minus and A you will be able to work at Equity Bank. I mean, that was really encouraging for that time. For a girl who was just from village to school, and then you were told after Form 4 you're going to work in a bank, in a corporate world, that felt good. And at the end of the four years, I managed to score an A, becoming the best in the school, and the best in the district, and among the best in the country. These uh, scholars were given uh, wings to fry uh, scholarships four years ago when they were transiting from free primary education or to paying secondary education. And after four years, they have uh, really demonstrated uh, the greatest uh, return on investment that a child given a chance and an opportunity, they can unlock their full potential. And sometimes it's barriers that hold us back uh, from realizing our dreams. So for our year, they chose scholars to join Equity Leaders Program who had an A in the country and who were top in their districts and also the Wings to Fly scholars who had attained at least an A- minus and above and I qualified for all of them. That's how I joined the Equity Leaders Program, went for an induction, a two weeks induction and was later posted at Molo Branch. At first it felt really challenging the people who had helped me previously as a Wings to Fly scholar in giving me my shopping, giving me my pocket money, are now my colleagues. I mean, that was shocking at first, but also good. The financial 
stability also and independence. At least I fetched some few money from the internship. I was also able to help out at home, send some few money to my parents to buy the basic needs, to buy food, to also pay for my, my sibling's school fees, a little amount. I was also able to buy my own clothes, not ask anyone for at least money to buy something. We were, we were mentored, we were tutored about the SAT, the Standard American Test, which we learned for some few months and did the exams. Uh, I passed the exams. I applied to Davidson for early decision and I qualified. I got in with our full scholarship. Davidson is in uh, North Carolina State, uh, the USA. Probably I'm going to study biomedical engineering at Davidson. Though it's an open curricular, that means I can choose anything that I want to study. But currently, I think I'll major in biomedical engineering. I chose biomedical engineering because uh, I believe our country still has a lot to do with healthcare and uh, I'm passionate about helping people get quality healthcare, quality machines that can help us diagnose diseases and treat them at the hospital. I believe success is not a personal success to yourself but I believe success is what you have left in other people's lives.